Hello, welcome to part three, see debugging. Okay, today we are going to take on the tax. So this tax, the tax says in most of the project they've been giving us a main file to test with. So for example, now the one of the main file they gave us is to test for this positive function in the earlier exercise, right? So based on the main function, the main, uh, the main dot C above, which is this one based on this main dot c above which is this one here okay based on this we should create a a file named zero dash main dot c this file must be tested with the this, this positive or negative function uh, in that case the correct output when it's given in the case of zero this zero here okay so our tax is to just we're not creating anything. Our tax is just to create this to file, upload this to file. This main zero dot main dot c and main dot h, which is the header. Okay. So now we are going to check all the headers. So this is this one. This one. This is one of the header. So this is sample for the header. Are you seeing it? Okay. That's what we are going to use. Which is the sample for the header. Then you can see we will put all the all the headers. In one folder including number one header this this number one question the header we are going to put them all together right so that by the time we are done we will not need to be coming for one of them number two we'll put all of them this uh, all this header we we'll put them together okay put them together put all of them yeah this you can see one here put them together you can see can see another one here. Mm -hmm. You can see. You can see this one here. So we we'll put all of them together. Then we we'll, so that we we'll have one file. So let's jump into our header file now. So we are ready in our directory. Let us create. Let's check what we have in our directory. Okay, now let's create the. Let's make the. OX3 dash debugging. Okay. And let's enter. So now let's see the tower debugging. Okay. Now let's check what we have here. We don't have anything. So the first thing we are going to do is to create the, the readme file. Okay. To readme file. It's going to carry the what the sorry. It's going to carry the <clears throat> network is really really slow. Uh -oh. So it's going to carry the um, three. Okay. Okay, then give me this MD. Okay, now we we'll there and let's list which we have. Okay, that's fine. And then the next thing we are going to do is to create the header file in our V editor main dot. Page okay, then you enter it, press insert on your keyboard, then you start typing the 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 the, the, the this syntax here. This is the beginning. You start with this one if and if okay. So that's what we are going to do right now. Let me quickly let me quickly populate it and come back. Okay, so you can see it. This is the first one for the number zero question. Okay, this is the number two, number three, and number three. So those are the questions that we are going to use. These are those are the headers we are going to use. So let's save it. So it's better we put them together so that we'll not be coming back here again. So save and close. This is that is the header. Then the next thing, let's clear our uh, our terminal. Then the next thing we are going to do is to create the dash zero dash main file. Okay, now 
to see so, yeah let's inspect in the chat and let's continue you know include include main dot head dot head which is the head okay enter the comment we are going to put the comment okay then another comment another comment so you can see the question this is it so just make sure you copy them and type the type it this way so let's let's close it let's go back now and visit it save it and let's clear our cache which other thing are we supposed to do again let's go back and check <coughs> yeah we have it already so now what do we do now we add let's add them to git um let's list who we have first let's make sure what we're done okay this is the file that is required of us okay yeah let's let's add them to git and on git commit Needs and okay. okay. What do we do next? We push it. Okay. Okay. Let's check our answer now. This delay is too much. Twenty-five seconds. Oh. Okay. Let's wait. For 25 seconds. I have to pause it, it's too much. Okay, so this is the answer. We have one, and there's no way we can check for the answer. So, after some research, I discovered that one of the one, one of the Razak, one of only the Amzat Zenab Razak said we should. I think it's 16. We should reduce it to 16 lines of code. Okay, let's check our V zero. Okay, let's check. If you count this line from here. Let's put the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15. I think 20 or everything 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, it's 20. So what do we do? Let's reduce it by, by 4 to make it 16 line. 1, 2, 3. Okay. That's a. <clears throat> that's a Let's reduce. Let's reduce. Okay. Now let's it's 16, now, 16 lines of code. Let's save and use it. Okay, git add all. Okay. A git git commit. Okay. Let's not check it. Thirty seconds delay. Wow, this is not much. Fantastic. You can see now it's correct. So that's the solution. Thank you very much. Please ensure that you subscribe and encourage me. Please. Thank you very much. Bye bye.